Hey guys, so I'm doing these blue ocean eyes today and the first thing I did was apply my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the shade Milk. If you've been watching the past couple videos of mine, I think in like all of them so far I've done this. I just love a white base, especially when I'm working with bright colors. Then I'm going to use a piece of tape and apply that from the lower bottom lash line to the outer corner of my eyebrow. And then I'm going to set everything with my Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. For my transition shade, I'm going to use Coastal Scents Aqua Eyeshadow. I'm going to use a big fluffy blending brush and I'm going to apply this in the upper crease of my eye. And yes, I do realize that I've been using Coastal Scents in all my videos so far. Um, to be honest, you know, my makeup collection is not all that big right now, but we will get there one day. I'm willing to try out new things, so if you guys have any recommendations, please let me know in the comments. For my Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette, I'm going to use the shades Jada and Pool Party. I'm starting off with Jada, that's the matte color on the left. And with a dense brush, I'm going to keep this mainly on the inner crease of my eye. I do bring it out towards the middle of my eye and a little towards the outer corner, but not too much. And then I ever so slightly blend it up towards my transition shade. After making sure everything is nice and blended, I'm going in with that same Jada color and I'm sweeping this across my lash line and across the tape. It's kind of hard to explain what I'm doing, but you can see here. It's really easy. Um, I think it's easier for sure if you use a really dense brush so that way the bristles aren't just like going crazy. You kind of keep it more in one spot where you want it to go. So for my lid, I'm going to do kind of like a little cut crease. I'm still definitely also learning how to do these, but I'm going in with a flat brush and some concealer and I'm carving that out. And then I'm also going to apply my pool party shade. That's that turquoise shimmery color. I feel like since there's three different turquoise colors going on, that shimmer, it just makes everything pop and add dimension. And then you'll also see me go back in with that shade Jada just to touch up that inner crease color. girl look at that reveal it's my favorite part it's so sharp so for my brow bone highlight i'm going to use estee cosmetics in the shade do me this is a highlighter i'm going to apply it to my inner corner as well later on and i'm going to curl my lashes put some mascara and i'm going to apply my lacy lashes in the style moon It's not a 
So I did skip over the part where I put my foundation on. I think I'll do a separate foundation video on that. If you guys want to see that, let me know. So I am showing you how I do my brows really quick. Um, I can also do a more in-depth video on this too if you guys would like. I honestly don't think my eyebrow routine is that special. I don't do much to it. But hey, I can show you guys. I don't mind. And I am using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in the shade Dark Brown. And I set everything with my Benefit Cosmetics 24-hour brow setter. Before I move on to my lower lash line, I'm applying my LA Girl Cosmetics Lip Plumper. So far, this is the best one that I've used and I do this every day. Like every day that I do my makeup, I put this on. Whether I'm doing natural or whether I'm going to take it off and apply like some crazy lip color. But for my lower lash line, I'm going to use a pencil brush with the shade Aqua. And after that, I use a dense flat brush and I'm going to add the shade Jada. Blend that out, go back in with the pencil brush, and blend it out some more. And for my eyeliner, I did just apply that NYX Milk Jumbo Eye Pencil. And for my mascara, I'm using my Maybelline Stiletto Mascara. I'll try to add everything that I used in the description box below. And here is the final look. I hope you guys like it. I love how it turned out. I know I always say that, but I mean, what can I say? When it comes out good, I'll be feeling good. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.